Because of this recent carbon monoxide leak in Rochester, we're sharing some advice from firefighters about what you can do to prevent incidents of toxic gas. KIMT News 3's Jerome Barnett is joining us live from Rochester Fire Station 1 with what we're hearing from RFD Captain Caleb Fine. Jerome. Just the captain says homeowners should have carbon monoxide detectors installed inside of their homes and have them checked regularly. Retailer home improvement stores like Walmart or Lowe's have them readily available for sale. Captain Fine says carbon monoxide is an odorless, colorless, and tasteless gas, so you'll want detectors to catch what you can. It would be a good idea to replace the detectors every 7 to 10 years. He says that the symptoms include nausea, fatigue, chest pain, shortness of breath, and flushed skin. You're looking at potentially being in a hyperbaric chamber to help force that carbon monoxide out of your bloodstream. Uh, depending on the severity of that exposure, again, it could lead to paralysis. It could lead to a lot of long-term effects in, in high enough doses. He says you should update the batteries in your carbon monoxide detectors at least once a year. And according to Mayo Clinic, anybody exposed to carbon monoxide should get fresh air and seek medical help right away. Live in Rochester, Jerome Barnett, KIMT News 3. Thank you, Jerome. RFD says it would be best to put detectors near your bedrooms since most of your time is spent there.